Hello guys, so I'm super excited to announce to you guys that I'm officially a senior data analyst here in the UK. Now just last week I you know got two job offers as a senior data analyst and you know it was super exciting because of the fact that I actually never intend changing my job yet. I just felt okay let me just push out the application and see what happens and you know I actually got two job offers. So yeah I decided to wait until I get um, you know an update from the home office after you know I got a job I got you know um, to apply or I had to inform the home office about my change of job and I just got back from the office just now and I got this letter in my mailbox from the home office and this letter contains decision on my application and also my new uh, BLP basically. So yeah, it's very exciting, you know, applying for a senior role. Uh, that's why the fact that at some point I felt I wasn't ready to apply for a senior role. But yeah, I had to overcome my fear, then applied and voila, I got two offers that I had to now sit down and you know look weigh the two offers and then make a decision on which of the offer I'll be going for. Of course I have made a decision. That's why I could apply, uh, you know, inform the home office about the recent updates. So yeah, if you're looking at getting into data analytics in the UK, then you want to stick to this video till the end, or you're currently a data analyst and you know you're having this imposter syndrome, you know, that's stopping you from applying for a senior role, then you sure do want to stick to this video so till the end. And if you're coming across my channel for the first time, come on, hit the subscribe button to join the amazing going family. My returning subscribers, you guys are amazing. Thank you for being here. So yeah, without further ado, let's get right into the video. For those who have been following my YouTube channel, many of you can remember when I made this particular video to share with you guys how I was able to transition into tech and got four job offers about two months before the end of my master's program here in the UK. Now I'm back again to share with you guys again that I just got two job offers as a senior data analyst here in the United Kingdom. So if you're looking at transition into data analytics and you're clueless on how to go about it, then you want to jump on a data analytics training with Tech Drive. All you need to do is to check out techdriveuk.com. Now on the website, you can check out the different opportunities available for those looking at transitioning into data analytics. So let's have a look. Now, if you go on Tech Drive website, you can see they help you grow your skills and launch your career in tech. And at the moment, they're currently offering data analytics training. You know, uh, it's a six weeks intensive training, um, a one-on-one -on -one training. So unlike other, you know, uh, training providers, Tech Drive provides a one-on-one -on -one training whereby it's just you and your assigned instructor all through the six weeks. So they're going to be training you on advanced Excel, SQL, Power BI. They're going to get trained by an experienced data analyst here in the United Kingdom. You get mentored. Your CV will also be properly structured to fit into that particular you know, um, job role you're applying for as a data analyst. And at the end of the training, you're going to get um, you know, a work reference on your CV and also a professional email for your work um, reference. So yeah, with data analytics, with Tech Drive, it's a one-on-one -on -one training. Um, you know, uh, you're going to get mentored by a professional. Now, these are some of the feedbacks from the students in different courses currently with uh, Tech Drive. So if you go on that courses, you're able to see, you know, a data analytics training for those who are interested in IELTS study material, um, those who would like to have probably you already, you know, um, highly skilled with data analytics statistical tools. You just want your CV to be written for you. You can check out that particular service provided by Tech Drive. Just click on learn more and it takes you straight to the website for you to learn, you know, or for you to get your CV structured. Now, Tech Drive is currently undergoing a six weeks training and the general course is going to be starting in um in the next couple of weeks starting on the 15th of january 2024 however the truth is currently they've got just three slots left for the january intake the november court is currently going on the registration is closed officially for november court because we've got um you know all the slot filled up however the january court is starting 15th of january and they've got just three slots left for that particular court so yeah what are you waiting for guys don't miss the opportunity go on their website or send them an email on techdrive06 at gmail.com or you know probably call the number on their website and start your application or start your registration to get into the next cohort for the data analytics training with tech drive trust me you'll be glad that you did now back to my experience applying for a senior data analyst role here in the uk now for those who have been following my channel i moved into um, a data analyst role transitioning into data analytics um, about seven months ago thereabout, 
and you know um, I decided to start pushing out the application for a senior role because I felt that my technical skills actually you know um, enough to be able to apply for a senior role and you know, I wasn't serious about it at first I had this imposter syndrome thinking oh I'm not good enough to apply for a senior role because applying for a senior role means that you're going to be managing you know junior analysts and all of those things and I felt okay I'm not good enough let me just chill with my role and the success is I'm actually happy with my current job role um, it's really one of the most fantastic job I've ever done and the team fantastic amazing so yeah i was a bit comfortable with what i was doing um i had no reason to want to leave the job and you know apply for a new job so i just chokingly just told you know a couple of my friends said oh yeah i'm thinking i'm ready to apply for a senior role and i pushed out some applications and you know just a couple of i was actually in morocco for um holidays when i got you know the um interview invite for this two you know um job roles and i felt okay do i want to accept this interview invite or just you know ignore the interview invite and yeah i you know uh spoke to some of my friends and they were like come on you have nothing to lose you've got a job already anyway so if they don't give you the offer you have nothing to lose you just move on and you learn from you know the rejection and all so yeah then i decided to push that application one of the uh you know uh, accept the interview invite now one of the interview was online while the second was physical so the one that was online i attended the interview the one for physical also i planned my you know travel arrangement and i also attended the last week um i got a call from the two organizations and they were like oh daniel you actually scored the highest mark you know among all the candidates that applied for the job role and we are happy to give you the offer and <laughs> the next question they asked was are you ready to accept in my mind i'm like why would I accept? It's a good news, honestly. Yeah, so yeah, I took up, you know, I accepted one, well, one of the offers and I'm going to be resuming in the next couple of weeks. And it's just super exciting to see the enormous opportunities available here in the UK, especially for those in data analytics. Yeah, I'm not where I want to be yet. However, come on, it's a step forward to, you know, from where um, I used to be basically. So yeah, I'm happy to take up the role. And I'm really looking forward to the, you know, different opportunities ahead of me. You know, of course, more challenges ahead of me. And the truth is, one of the many questions some of my friends asked me when I, you know, told them about the good news of this job role was the question of, did I upskill? Was there anything I did differently? And the truth is, my current job role really revolves around me making use of different advanced Excel, um, you know, um, functions, you know, getting to use VLOOKUP, you know, VBA, macro, pivot chart, and what have you. And also, you know, doing a lot of um, ETL processes as extraction, transformation, and loading processes in SQL. And also Power BI is what we use for visualization. So one of the things I did while I was on my job role basically was to upskill a bit. So I decided to, you know, dive into Python and R. I think the upskilling was also one of the factors that really helped in, you know, I'm getting this new job role as a senior analyst. So yeah, I know I still have a lot of things to learn because the truth is learning is progressive, especially in data analytics, new things, new, you know, approach, you know, of you doing your job role basically would always, you know, emanate and yeah, you just have to keep learning. So yeah, super excited with this new journey. I really don't know what to expect, but yeah, I'm looking forward to, you know, what is going to happen on um, the job role basically. So yeah, that's it. So I'm now a senior analyst and yeah, Let's see what's going to happen. So yeah, if you have any questions, if you're looking at transition into data analytics and you've got lots of questions to ask, please put it in the comment section. And if you have any private, you know, information you would like to, you know, share with me and ask questions and you don't want to share in the comment section, you can jump on my one-to-one -one session. Just click on the link in the description of this video and we're going to have a chat. You know, we're going to have a phone conversation for you to share your questions and your thoughts with me basically. Yeah. So and if you're coming across my channel for the first time, what are you waiting for? Come on, hit the subscribe button to join the amazing growing family and my returning subscribers. Thank you guys for being here. I really do appreciate you guys. So yeah, this will be the end of this video and I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you.